Hey, welcome everybody. In this video, we're going to look at how you can play Guess Who on a Google Jamboard. Uh, this specific one I would be using for primarily clothing uh, and colors and sizes and stuff like that. We could also use uh, hair colors and things. Uh, so to make the Guess Who, which ultimately looks like this, uh, the first thing I did was I found some royalty-free pictures on the internet, uh, which these ones I got from uh, depositphotos.com and istockphoto.com. And I grabbed those pictures and I put them into a Google drawing. And then I arranged them how I wanted them. So this is actually just two different pictures, uh, this one and this one. And then I added some names underneath the people in these text box boxes here. So you can see that. And of course I added this picture also. And then when I was done, uh, I just go to uh, file and then uh, download. And then I saved it as a JPEG. Um, oh, before I do that also, the very first thing I would do is page setup and change the size to a 16 by 9 because it fits the Jamboard better. So uh, you can have your jam set up here with all of these pictures of people, their names. And then what you're going to do is jump on over to your Jamboard. And then you're going to set the background by going here and then to image. You'll find that saved image file and then you'll save it as the background. Uh, the only thing I added on here is a bunch of purple boxes over here in the direction this right here you can be deleted the purple boxes can be used to cover up the people that are eliminated since there are 20 there are 21 of these purple boxes since there are 22 characters uh, so for example if i were to say um you know esta persona tiene uh, pelo amarillo this person has yellow hair then i can start grabbing these yellow boxes and covering up anybody that doesn't have yellow hair or blonde or whatever you want to call it and i also made if you see up here at the top uh, 19 more copies of this page right here and on the all of the other copies the ones that the students would use I included a sticky note that has the directions of how you can use these purple boxes to cover up the characters and then you can play this with your students you by the way are welcome to use this if you want to uh, change the names uh, and use it for maybe la classe de, uh, la classe de français or some other language if you want to change things up you can do that as well there's a link in the description of the video that will allow you to make a copy of this uh, jamboard and all 20 of its slides uh, if you have a class larger than 20 you could always just um, duplicate this jamboard and then the students you know 20 of the students can access this jamboard and then the other students could access your other jamboard i hope that you don't have over 40 students uh, in your classes so that's how i made this um, guess who game uh, within Google Jamboard. If you want more tips on using Google Jamboard, be sure to check out the playlist uh, on my channel. I'll put a link to that as well in the description of this video. Thanks for watching, guys. We'll see you in the next one. Hasta luego.